here we are, our Armagranite previous video. We took this thing and we took the brushed setup out of it. We put a Ghoul RC 60 amp brushless setup in it. And that was good. We showed it, gained about five miles an hour. We were at 24 with that Ghoul RC 60 amp setup in it, but wasn't really actually very happy with it. I mean, we're supposed to be giving this away to one of you guys. I, and it just really honestly didn't it didn't feel that good at all and so what we're gonna do is we have a hobby wing sc8 ready to run esc that we are going to i believe these are pulled out of red cats frequently we're gonna throw this one in it um higher amperage even up to 4s lipo capable if this doesn't get this truck moving nothing will so if you're new to the channel welcome my name is troy this is roadside rc on this channel we will do the bashing crawling the drifting sometimes we'll do some racing and we're even getting into the fbv drone stuff but today we are trying to see if we can't upgrade the performance in this granite mega Here we are, GPS to record setting zero to S LiPo. Now this thing will take actually a four, three S and a four S now. So hey, let us know down in the comments. Do you want us to do a video two S versus three S? There's four S that could be kind of fun. It could also wreck something. So let us know down below. All right, two S speed run, here we go. brakes is that full throttle no. oh we'll open it up that's not full throttle is it full throttle oh, i can't tell if that's better or not so reminder we were at 24 miles an hour with the ghoul rc ESC. All right. What's your guess, Logan? I say 30. You say 30. You think it gained six more miles an hour? 28. So that's interesting, though. So, Ghoul RC setup honestly didn't drive great. The ESC, I think there might have just been something wrong with that ESC because we've had good luck out of those things before. But 24 miles an hour. Now all we do is change ESC and we gain four miles an hour. We're doing 28 just like that. And it's just 2S. Two 2S two and it'll do a 3S and it'll do a 4S. All right, hey, let's do a just general run in the front yard and see if it feels better than the other motor. Did. If you stop over here and then just go. Let... And full speed. Oh, that's a slipper clutch. Oh gosh, that was slipper clutch big time. <laughs> it didn't cog. <laughs> Is the throttle more responsive? Yeah. Yeah, the throttle response on that uh, Ghoul RC just wasn't very good, all that kind of stuff. This is a lot better. So that is really, really exciting overall. This is really good. As it turns out, this Ghoul RC motor, this uh, speed control here, it just wasn't good enough for this vehicle. Now we ran it in the two wheel drive granite, or great. I think it'll be good for some other vehicles. The motor, as it turns out, the 3900 KV, that's great in there, it's fine. Yeah, it just needed a bigger ESC to push it. So, hey, you know we're going to be doing this. We're going to be giving this truck back away. But before we do that, we're going to take it out. We're going to take it to the skate park. We're going to maybe do a jump session with it, something like that. We're going to see if there's any other upgrades, anything else that we should do to this thing before we give it out, give it away. If you know of any must-do upgrades, let us know down below in the comments. We'll consider it. We'll see what needs to happen with it. So, anyway check it out this is awesome really really happy with this granite stay in touch hit that subscribe button and we really appreciate all the support that you guys give to the channel so stay in touch with us you know hit those notifications turn all those notifications on all that kind of stuff come over here check out some other videos and everything that we have going on i really really appreciate it when you guys do that so thank you and we'll talk to you later goodbye